almost done. Almost uh, the basic premises are laid out by others, so I will uh, limit myself to one of the points. In a country where a democratic government is being elected, is funded by electoral bonds, which are very secretive, confidential, in a country where everything is transpired in a sealed cover culture. I am afraid cinema too is moving towards that sealed cover zone. That is why they want to control everything from one a remote control center. It's simple for me. And the person uh, born and brought up in Ireland in Gulf Waters, joined film division, moved around in India and really understood what is that Indianness which we talk about by encountering different Indias, especially in North East. I really feel very sad this organization, Film Solution, which created jewels in the past, will be corporatized, already been done. I'm not saying everything is going to be doomed, but here in this scenario, we filmmakers are interacting with another filmmaker who is pitching to make a film in film solution. Otherwise, if you really go to other pitching sessions of European documentary network and all, you can see how these funders are making the filmmakers performers. They have to perform to impress upon. So we don't have big claim, all claim. But we did our bit because the public sector space was existing. Now, I think it's a micro passing. Uh, but in this whole policy of merging everything into a corporation, there is a clear cut case for a public investigation in the case of national film archives. All the filmmakers have donated their films, the prints, to the government of India to preserve. To archive. Now you cannot half the way change it and then you know change your policy and there is a clear cut legal uh, policy. Talking about all logic, shame, nothing matters here. Like you are the next the other today in an interview was telling uh, I don't know the name I'm getting to the topic. Uh, he's not a person, he is a phenomenon. It's a phenomenon, then how will you deal with that? That is why if you really see Anand Patwarjan's film, when he was dealing with a personality like Bal Thakare, it was very effective. But how do you deal with the phenomenon in a documentary film? So we are actually in trouble, but there is a public interest litigation angle in the national film market. Thank you.